Well, hello, awesome equestrians. I've got something I'm going to do today. I am getting rid of this. His mane gets so tangly, it's unruly, and I just want to get it gone. So, some people may not like this, but I've never done it before and I want to try it. So, I'm going to use my clippers and roach Ethan's mane. This could be interesting. We shall see. All right, I got clipper oil or coolant. I have the clippers and lots of treats. So I'm going to start with his bridle path because he's used to me doing that and then we'll go from there. Good boy. I just reinforce that the clippers are not bad and he gets a treat. And then before he can pull away, I take the clippers away from his head. So it's my idea, not his. You're so pretty! You're so pretty! And sometimes he likes to play with brushes, so I'm going to put this here in case he decides he has to play and give him something to do. So now we're halfway done. I'm gonna put some more lubricant on the clipper so they stay cool and then they don't pull. The lubricant helps to keep the blades cool. It lubricates them so they move freely with each other and it just makes them work better. So when he started to pick his head up a little bit and act like a little bit nervous, then again, I pulled the clippers away, making it my idea, not his idea to stop. He needs more treats. He needs more treats. All right, so that's one side. Now I'm gonna brush through it real quick, make sure we didn't miss anything. 
on on this side. keep that because I like him to have some bangs. And then I'm just going to touch up and make sure everything's nice and even on this side. Then we'll go to the other side. I like that side. Now we go to the other side. And I don't know if you can see it, but even though I did the other side, it's still uneven and there's pieces on this side. So I need to trim those up too. So again, I'm starting on a new side. So it's a new side of his brain. So I need to get him some treats. So we make this a good experience. Yeah. And once I'm done clipping everything, I'm going to add a little bit of the hair moisturizer to help moisturize where his mane was because he might be a little bit itchy now. And then that also shows me if there's any little pieces that I missed. We didn't miss any, we did a good job. I don't know if you can see that, but this is the aftermath of Ethan getting his hair cut. Kind of hard to see in the shade. That was a lot of hair that came off, but I think that looks a lot better. It's nice and even and clean and neat and no more tangly mane. I like it. It looks a lot neater. It will be easier to take care of him. And I think he looks pretty good. Have you ever cut off your horse's mane or roached your horse's mane? Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think. Don't hate, I just wanted to try it. And I really like how it turned out. So I think it's pretty cool. Might be a pain in the butt when it grows back. We shall see. Thank you so much for watching my video today. I'd love to have you subscribe to my channel. There's over 400 videos waiting for you to view and three new videos each and every week. So be sure to subscribe to my channel. Then you can see all the new videos. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next video. With my bald horse. Sorry, thanks.